Welcome to the how-to series by Get Your Guide. On this video, we will be talking about our integration analyzer and teaching you how to install it. Let's start with some basic FAQ. What and why the integration analyzer? The integration analyzer offers detailed insights into your link and widget performance. It enables us to provide you with unique insights, reports, and personalized recommendations to rec maximize your earnings. What metrics does the integration analyzer offer? The analyzer is able to provide you with impressions, which are views, visitors, which means clicks, click-through rate, bookings, and conversion rate for every integration, link, or widget. You can easily find out what's most engaging for your audience and use these insights to increase your chance of additional earnings. Will the integration analyzer slow down my website? No, the analytics script is asynchronous and will not impact how fast your page content loads. Is the integration analyzer GDPR compliant? Yes, the analytics script is part of our standard affiliate program offering, which is governed by the partnership agreement. We can also confirm that the script is not dropping any third-party cookies, nor do we share any of the data with third parties. There are a few ways on how to install the analyzer script. Most commonly, people add it in between the HTML tags of your website. You can find the analyzer script under the tools and click on any widget. Look for install on your analytics code and copy it to the clipboard. Now let's see how you install the script using WordPress. The analytics code needs to go between the HTML head tags of the page. But how do you get there? There are two possibilities on how to add the analytics code to your header. You might actually be able to see both, one, or neither. The first way to find your head tag is click on Appearance, then Theme File Editor. On the left side menu, you want to look for Theme Header. Now search for the closing head tag and paste the analytics code before it. Another way you might be able to find the header is to click on Settings and find Header and Footer. Once selected, look for the Head Page section and paste your analytics code there and it's all set. We hope this was helpful. See you next time.